guys, my name is Angelo Agartela. Today we're out here in the coolest restaurant probably that you have in Paris. It's the Jules Verne. And the location of this restaurant is actually magnificent. And that's because this restaurant is actually on top of the Eiffel Tower. At this moment, we're about to go inside. And I'm gonna be showing you guys what it's like to go up there, to have a meal. And then in the end, I think we have a very nice view of Paris. So stick around and enjoy. I've been very excited to come to this place since it's a pretty sweet location, of course. But also, it has a Michelin star. Within that rating system, it means that this establishment offers exceptional cuisine and that it's worth a special journey. Fancy terminology to say that it has street cred from the Michelin Man. Many highly influential personalities enjoy coming here. A few examples are the number one Mexican supporter, Donald Trump, the French president, Emmanuel Macron, the super secret spy, James Bond, also known as 007, and of course, the world's greatest YouTube superstar, myself. So if you haven't yet, make sure to like and subscribe so that I can continue doing cool stuff. Now, to the experience. The entrance for this restaurant is pretty cool since it's located at the south pillar of the Eiffel Tower. It's worth noting that since it is such a prestigious establishment, they have a dress code which does not allow sneakers, but they kindly made an exception for myself. We entered an elevator that took us all the way up and it was pretty cool since you could see the tower structure. Once we arrived to the place, we were escorted to our table. In our case, we had a table in the main room which had a pretty nice view of the city of Paris. I was accompanied to this wonderful experience by my beautiful girlfriend and something interesting was that when we got the menus, only mine had prices. The experience offered a tasting menu, which as it's typical for bougie places, involved very small dishes. To be fair, you don't eat huge dishes. Although small, the quality of the stuff we got was great. Little pieces of gold, caviar, foie gras, amongst other things, made for a great change to the instant noodles that I'm used to eating. About every hour, the Eiffel Tower turns disco mode and it goes all sparkly. And while that looks pretty cool from the outside, we got to experience how that looked from the inside this time, and that was wonderful. After we were done with our meal, we got access to a platform where we had an amazing view of the city. I found a very nice beam in which I did a pull-up, because that's nice, and we enjoyed the view for a bit before concluding our night. And that concluded the experience. Overall, the experience had unmatchable levels of swag, so I would definitely rate it a 10 out of 10, and I would recommend it without a doubt to anyone who has the means to do it. I hope you enjoyed this video almost as much as I enjoyed sharing the experience with you guys. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Adios!